What's up, many guys? I do welcome to my channel. It's your boy Connor85, and I'm back in the cut. If you're new, guys, make sure you subscribe and also hit that bell notification so you know when I release a video, guys. And also make sure you follow my Instagram link, which I will leave down below. So today we're talking about all things supreme. I released a partial drop list a couple of hours early, so now we're gonna do the full supreme list for this Thursday. So it's a special week as Supreme is linked up with the Italian luxury house called Pucci as I spoke about it already. And so we're trying to take our information from Supreme League News. So without any further ado, guys, we'll just get to it. Uh, just give us a couple of seconds and I'll show you what I'm looking at. So we have got the Supreme Sea Dew Jet Ski, which is also expected to release this week as well. It's got a lot of stickers on them as well. If you're a high beast, you know, you always put your Supreme stickers and whatnot onto your laptop as well. But this time it's been done on a jet ski as well, which is going to be quite expensive. It looks like a smaller jet ski. It's not the bigger one. It's just probably for one person, I'd probably say. Maybe two is a bit of a squeeze. This will cost a lot of money. I'll probably say £6,000 at least, you know. And um, yeah, there'll probably just be a handful. At least maybe, I think, I don't know, 50 to 100 Bigger part on units. And I think they'll all be available just in the USA as well. So if you're outside of USA... I don't think, you know, you're going to have a chance to get these unless you buy them on the resale market. And I think even the resale price is going to be insane as well. So I don't think it's worth it to buy as such. You know, I don't know. If you got the money, then go for it. Fair enough. But even if you buy it, like, um, what do you do with it? If you own, like, a sneaker store, then I suppose you can buy it and put it in the middle as an accessory um, as such. But, yeah, it just doesn't really do much as such. So we'll just uh, hit the link in the bio then we'll just go to the full list um, and just, yeah, just go from there, guys. And if you guys got any questions at all, make sure you just comment down below. Also, like this video as well, guys, so we can, you know, get as many, many, many views as possible and go up the algorithm as well. So we spoke about this before. So obviously, the, one of the biggest highlights is the Burger Log, which is coming out as well. It's got the geometric, you know, shapes from Pucci as well. Um, I do think the black one is one of the best ones. The gray, I'm not really kind of keen on, but I think the black, because of the fact that it's got color behind it, I think it's the one that I'd probably go for. And obviously we've covered that, the uh, jet ski there. So we'll skip the jet ski there. So you've got these Supreme Montana mini cans. I do like these. Um, I think as an accessory, it would be nice to have. But I think one thing I'm kind of scared of is the price is going to be, you know, just slightly over the price. So is it worth the price? I don't know. What do you guys think? Probably not. We've always spoke about the burger logo, guys. And I say the burger is going to be one of the theme things to get. Uh, it's going to make some money. Uh, what do you guys think about the burger logo? One thing I think I'm not kind of really keen on is the shape of the T-shirt. I didn't speak about this before, but looking at this now, the T-shirt is just kind of a weird shape. It's not a boxy shape as such. So it's a minor complaint, really. Supreme fits always like a nice fit. So I can't really complain as such. This will obviously retail for, I think, $45. It should resell for over $200. Easily, easily. For certain colors, though, not every color is going to retail, I think. So it resell for a lot of money. This is just an estimate, an educated guess. I'm just, you know, doing a forecast based on the uh, past releases. So it's not the final resale figure. StockX obviously decides that, you know. Um, what color are you guys going to try and go for? So that's the white one. The white one is actually quite nice as well. Um, I do love the color on the uh, burger itself, you know, with the different geometric shapes. That's a nice vibe. Apparently, the geometric shapes come from the 60s and 70s. So it's been influenced by that. That era of um, art, you know, had those sort of colors. For me, I thought it was more of a, I think, a stained glass look. But yeah. So the gray is not really my fondest color, to be fair. I think the gray is all right, but I'm not really leaning towards it. I do love the Zippo lighter. I'm going to try and get this. I'm literally going to try and get this. This is one of the top items I'm going to try and get. Obviously, the Boga logo and this as well. Um... I do like this as well, the soccer jersey. It's it's nice, but I think I'd prefer like in a lighter color. Well, look at the lighter color. This one is not bad as well, but I think when it's a lighter color, it kind of, you know, it's got that like summer punch, you know, that summer punch to it, which this one rather lacks. 
So you got the world is yours hoodie sweatshirt. So the world is yours came from this film by Al Pacino called Scarface. If you haven't seen that film, you're missing out on life. It was one of these, uh, you know, iconic gangster films. So make sure you guys go check that out. It's from the 80s as well. It is really, 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 really good. They don't make gangster films like that anymore. So this comes from that. So you're sitting like, um, you know, outside by the pool area and it's got a balloon that says the world is yours. He's achieved everything that he could ever achieve. And, you know, he, you know, he, he's just looking at that thing which says the world is yours. So that was a nice little, nice little statement there for Supreme to pay attention to. So you've also got the Pucci sports jacket. So you can tell there's a lot of Italian influence, very strong Italian fashion couture, you know, behind it, you know, with the silk as well. We've seen with the Versace shirts for men, the luxurious ones that always come, you know, with that silk. This also is, you know, similar sort of style. Even the, uh, the sports jackets, you know, a lot of Italians are going to play their mafia films always appear wearing these, you know, these sports jackets. So you, you can see that as well. One thing, as I said, is I cover that already with the soccer jersey. This doesn't have the color. I do love color for summertime. I don't think I'd wear this in winter. So as you guys can see with the Pucci shorts, so, you know, the colors are very, you know, in your face. They're like these pastel, beautiful colors which go together. So that jacket that I've just spoke about above, it also comes in this color as well. So just imagine that jacket in this color, it'll be beautiful. I will not speak about resale price for these because I can't really, you know, I, I haven't got an idea how much they're gonna resell for. But one thing I would say, it's gonna be a slightly pricey release. So do you expect that? Because it's, you know, um, you know, obviously a luxurious brand. So yeah. I do like these. I don't know for some reason. Like I, sh I know I shouldn't like these, but I do like these belts. Um, just purely for I think for my own fashion sense. Just picture this, right? So you wear some uh, brown chinos. You got some loafers on, some brown loafers. Then you wear either the pink one at the bottom there. Then you wear like a white shirt as well. Do you know what I mean? Then you, I don't know, like wear maybe a hat which is probably like got one of the colors there, like maybe a pink hat. I don't know, it's a vibe for summertime, you know? If you're going to the horse races, the ascot, you're laughing, really. It's a nice look. I do like it. Even the top one as well, I do like it as well. If you're wearing all black, then you just wear that as well. It breaks, you know, the outfit nicely. Then you can wear some white uh, sneakers on the bottom just to break it off as well. And the white also picks up with the colours on the belt as well. It's a nice look as well. So if you're going for that sophisticated look, you know, this is it, this is it. I do love the shades for some reason. I know I shouldn't like them, but I do love the shades. I'm not sure how much they're going to cost, you know, but I wouldn't mind a pair for summertime as well. I just wouldn't mind. Definitely. These are nice. I've got to say, Supreme, you've done really well. You've saved the best for the last. But it would be nice to also get in between these releases some nice pieces as well. Then you got this uh, mesh pocket cargo jacket. I do like this. I do like this as well. Like I like how the Supreme labels is on the uh on the mesh pocket it's not in your face i do love the it's like a blush pink that's a nice color i do love this i'm not sure about the resale so i'll probably not comment on that so yeah it'll be nice to see this in different colors probably black i would like also purple as well i think purple will vibe as well it's nice especially like during springtime when it still gets a bit chilly at night time you might want to put this on but at the same time you won't feel like as if you're boiling hot now, with this as well, I was saying to my girlfriend, this is more like a, it's got the kimono vibes, and I do love this um, in a different color. I saw it in a different color. I do like it just for like when you're lounging, but it's a very expensive thing to wear in the house when you're lounging. I do like it. Not this color scheme though, but I saw a different color scheme before. Then with these, I do love. Do you know what it is? This is what I was saying before, like with the Versace shirts. This is like, you know, what you'd wear in summertime when you go overseas. You'd wear this with some matching. I'd probably say wear, wear this with some matching. I hope they sell the matching shorts as well. Then you can wear some crisp, brand new Air Force ones that are white. You know, that'd be a nice, beautiful look to have. What do you guys think? Comment down below. I think this is going to be, you know, a vibe this summertime, definitely. Um, it's probably going to be geared for a slightly older audience or customer base, such as moi. You know, who does appreciate this? I don't see like a 14 year old, you know, 20 year old appreciating this. Maybe 25 and above. Yeah, us oldies. 
The cap I'm not really quite fond of. It's a bit tacky. I think if you wear the cap as well with everything, it will just look just a bit too noisy. Um, yeah, so I'll probably shy off on that. So these I'm not quite fond of these the jack sorry the these match the jackets. I think when you wear the two, it just becomes a little bit too noisy. You're almost like a clown. So I probably steer away from this. But I mean you guys can buy it if you want to, you know. I see I do like this shirt, guys. So here's what I was thinking, right? So I was thinking like if you wear this shirt, you're either gonna wear a trouser which is black or either white. Or even red as well. So that gives you a lot of options. So if you're going to go out for a night out, you're taking your lady or you're going with your boys out to like a nice place like the Shard. You know, um, you're going to Nobu, Hakkasan, Sexy Fish, the Shard, you know, Novikov. This will be the look to wear, especially in summertime, you know, when it's just beautiful. Everyone's wearing different colors. This will be a definite vibe. You'd also wear some nice Versace or Gucci loafers as well, just to match this as well. You know what I mean? That grown and sexy look. Or you can either wear some red bottom loafers as well. That'd be a nice little choice to have as well. I do like this. I do like the color itself. I know it's a bit noisy, but you can still make it work. If you know what I mean. If you know how to make it work, trust me, you can make it work. I'll probably like wear this also with some... Um, have you seen those uh, Gucci sunglasses? They've got like... Um, they've got red as well. I'll either wear some Louis Vuitton uh, sunglasses, you know, the thick framed ones with the red... With this, mate, I'm telling you vibes. So we spoke about the jacket before. This is the matching. Uh, uh, so you got the shorts there. Then you've also got the tracks as well. I wouldn't want to wear all, you know, all blush or all pink. That's not a vibe. Then you've also got the, you know, obviously Supreme has to have the basic, you know, items in case you've not got the the more desired items. You can still buy this as a consolation prize. This I'm going to trash it. It's crap. I won't even waste so much time. Now, then you've got the hoodie as well. I'm not really a fan of the hoodie itself because, it, you know, yeah, I'm not really a fan of the hoodie itself. It's just like, yeah, it's not as classy as wearing the shirt itself, I feel. So this is trash. I'm going to trash it. I know you guys are thinking like it's the same thing as a, as a shirt, but it's not. Because you can wear a shirt like in different places and you can make it work. Where's this? I feel like you can't. Then you've got the caps as well, which I'm going to trash as well. I ain't got time for that. Then you've got the beanie hats, which are nice. I do like them for... Festival time. We're now obviously going back to festivals in September, so this would be nice just to wear. But some of the patterns is just a little bit too rich for me. So you got the the S logo pocket tee, which I think is trash. I would just trash that. It's just like, yeah, they could have done better. They could have just done better. The thing with Supreme, they shouldn't just rely on collaborations. They should also make their clothes look desirable as well. Then you got the basketball, you know, tee, which I think is yeah, it's just. It's crap. I'm going to trash that as well. It's just so many things going on. So many colors. It's just like, yeah. Then you've got the bottom as well, which matches the hoodie itself. I mean, imagine wearing both of them and you're out during the day. <laughs> you're like a clown, bro. You can't, be, you can't be getting caught wearing this. So that's the end of the video, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Just want to say, guys, keep watching, keep subscribing. Let's get the views up, guys. And yes, guys, make sure you also follow my Instagram. Follow my Instagram, which I've left down below, so we can talk as well, etc., etc. I'm out, guys. Have a good night. God bless you. Much love and appreciation. We up, baby.